Hey guys, welcome to Zexpress. Let's see how we can get started with an easy guide to create a custom registration form into WordPress site. So the custom registration forms are essential for gathering specific information from users. Whether this is from a membership site, a webinar, or a community platform, in this 2023 tutorial, we're gonna be showing you how to build and customize a user registration form without any hassle. So let's jump to right in. Now setting up, before we start, I wanted to show you and look into your WordPress dashboard and creating a custom registration form is simplified with the help of, of plugins. One such popular plugin is user of registration. How you can find it is to go directly into the pod. Go into plugins and go for add new plugin. Once you are in here, there's two things that you can do. It's to type in here and let's say for example that we wanted to go for registration form or just a form. The keyword explorer should be showing you a lot of elements that you can use in order to get started. So in this case, let's go for the jetpack contact form. I'm gonna hit now to get started. Now, once the plugin is activated, you want to go into the user registration on the dashboard and click and add a new to create a new form. Now, the plugin offers a drag and drop builder, making it easy to add and organize fields into your form. You want to add standard fields like name, the email, the passcode, or any custom fields that you actually need. So as you can see, we have now the actual element of how it's going to be looking here. But let's go back here and let's activate a new custom form field. Now I'm going to go here into the pod where I have my contact section. Here are my contact form. And as you can see, here's the part where I wanted to get add a new one. So here into add new, and as you can see, here's my form. So customizing your form fields. Now customizing is fee key for registration forms. To click on any field to edit its properties. You can change the labels. You can add a placeholder text, make a field required. This level of customization is sure you gather all the necessary information from users. So also explore additional settings like users role excitement upon the registration. So you can see the form that appears here. You can change the mail. You can change the messages. You can change the additional settings, for example. So to, from, subject, additional headers, message body, file attachment here, enter the title here, of course, how to look in your contact form. And you have the name, the email, the subject, the message, the submit, something really easy if you don't know how to get started there. So everything, of course, has been added automatically. You can add a URL, for example, the name, the default value, the ID, whatever. You can insert the tag if you want to. So I can add, for example, like a new drop-down menu and adding like an option, like an, like an ID attribute, class attribute, here how the file, if this is required file, or if it's not. Now let's go for, uh, let's say for example, like a number. Take your time to add all the errors that you kind of need. After that, hit now into save, and the status has now been completed. Now the styling your form. Now let's make sure your form basically appealing. The use of registration plugin allows you to adjust the styling of your form. So we're going to go here into your uh, settings, and you can add, for example, the integration of reCAPTCHA, for example. Um, actually, it's gonna be really, really simple, the contact form, because you can not edit like a lot of that. But uh, I believe, let's see, this is just easy to get started with. I have more than enough just to get started with the contact form, since we already been created this one. So the show code is actually that one, and hit now into apply, and we're actually good to go. Now, adding the form to your site. Once your form is ready, it's time to add this to your site. You can save the form and you will get a show code, which is actually this one. And paste the WordPress editor uh, and paste the show code to the WordPress editor and publish it into your page. For example, here into pages, I go here and look out for contact us, for example, or just registration one. If you don't have one, let's go for add a new page. And now I have the add new page section and maybe we can choose a contact form template. If you don't see templates, you can get started with something easy. For example, here into add title, I have just pasted it. And as you can see, we have something really easy, your name, your email, the subject, the message and submit. Something really easy, but I believe it's really be fast enough to add into our store. So that's it guys. You have successfully created and customized registration form into your WordPress site. Simple, right? If you find this story helpful, please give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to Express for more WordPress tips and tricks. Any questions or experience with creating a form, feel free to share them into the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching uh, the video. Stay tuned with Express for more quick and easy WordPress guides. Hopefully we can all see you on our next video.